Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're taking a look at Mia's Wildlife Reserve from Lego Friends. This is set 41717 with 418 pieces and I believe retailed for $50. You might be able to tell it comes with two animals and three mini dolls. So let's get right into it. First giving you guys a look at the mini dolls, which this one is so cute. This is Joaquim. And I love the hairpiece. The little afro is super cute. And he looks like he's dressed in some wildlife clothing there. And the shorts. And he's got little shoes. Really cute little buddy there. Next up, this is Dr. McKenna. Um, I'm not really sure what makes her a doctor. She looks the same age as everybody else. But nonetheless, there she is. And she has a cute little printed vest and a very cool looking hair piece there. Lego Friends always gets the cool styled hairs. <laughs> and lastly, we have the main friend from the Friends line. This one is Mia, and Mia's usually always into like wildlife and stuff, so she usually comes with these kind of sets, which I personally find very interesting. Alrighty, taking a look at the wildlife rescue area, we have um, probably just, I'd say two main pieces here. We have a little uh, foresty tree section, with a scorpion, um, which is pretty fun. It has a teeny tiny waterfall. There's a scorpion there, as well as a tree that the giraffe can eat from. Um, if you turn it around, there is this little area to push the scorpion out, so I guess he can kind of go on the attack. Um, gives the character something to do, and it just kind of, you push that back and it just houses right inside there. It's a nice navy colored scorpion, I really like it. And then if you have the giraffe, it's a good height to eat these leaves from. This is the giraffe that comes with the set. Um, looks kind of Duplo-y to me, to be honest, rather than Friends-like, but pretty cool nonetheless. She's got eyelashes. You can, if you want, stand a mini doll on the giraffe. Um, it also reaches the top floor of the wildlife rescue to eat, if you prefer, um, which I think is actually kind of neat. And then there is, of course, shrubbery on the other side very, very briefly as well. Taking a look at the front of the rescue, these stickers are very cool, um, very like African inspired or what you'd see maybe at like Disney World or at like a zoo. I actually really, really like it. And then there is a little symbol there in front of the door that shows it's like a wildlife rescue. It looks like an elephant, a leaf, a, a giraffe, and a band-aid. I don't know if I'm seeing that correctly, but there is a welcome mat and we have a lot of open window space. Um, there is a sticker of a lizard like it is crawling up the side there. And it's just overall very cute looking. We have a little satellite on top um, and then this little bay area to come out and like feed and tend to the giraffe. In the garage here though, we do have a small vehicle, which is actually quite cool. Um, we have the same logo sticker here. It does fit a mini doll with a little pressure um, groove there between its uh, the feet. Looks like there is a box of perhaps supplies with one singular flower inside. And then on the back we have some binoculars and this is a little contraption to catch that scorpion. It's like a little hook, um, kind of like what you'd use for a snake or something, but very cute. And as I said, it does fit a mini doll. There is no actual windshield and no doors and no steering wheel. So it is a very small build, but nonetheless, you can see the face right there. And I do like this front grill. That's actually pretty cool. And then one last thing that you can't see from the back is it looks like this little ant farm that there is a picture of here. Um, just inside the door, as well as a super cute <laughs> April 2022 calendar, which is when the set came out. That's actually quite cute. I like that that's a sticker piece there. It's pretty neat. Flipping this set around, and we do have a uh, pretty fun amount of features, I would say. I really like the color scheme of this with its kind of like neutrals um, and like peaches. I think it looks very like plainsy, if you will. Um, this is the back part of the garage that the little Jeep can drive into. And then we have what looks like a doctor's office downstairs with a scale for the animals. Um, the other animal that you get is upstairs here. It is a baby zebra. Um, the only thing is, is with this scale, you can get the zebra in there just barely, but you certainly can't get the giraffe. And you also have some tools. You have a needle, a stethoscope, um, one of those uh, ear things where you can like look into ears. 
And then there's a little scale piece sticker here. Um, we have this removable section, which I'm not 100% sure if this is supposed to be a tablet or a phone. Um, if it is a phone, I'm not sure why they decided to put it on a book piece and then sticker it. That's a little bit weird to me, honestly. There's nothing on the other side. There's lots of clips throughout this set, kind of all over. Um, so you could hook this anywhere. I just have it on this side one here. And then there is a medical chart specifically for the baby zebra. Looks like it has something wrong with its leg. Um, and I do like the little plastic molded piece for the, the medical chart, that's pretty good. Um, on the back here, we have a sink with some other sanitary equipment. Looks pretty good. And then upstairs we have, looks like um, the layout of the animal rescue in general with a computer. Uh, we have a microscope, looks like it is studying something. And then we have an x-ray machine with the little x-ray light. So you can basically put the zebra in here like this and it looks like it's x-raying the zebra. Yeah, and it does have a, a problem with its foot. And then the little balcony, there is a doorway that you can come out through here and then you can actually set a mini doll on this like little chair here. You probably have to kind of balance them because again, mini dolls don't have studs on their butts. So there you go. Um, yeah, and then the little draft can come over and visit. Um, and overall, I think it's actually a pretty cute set. It's not too bad for the price. There's like a lot of like make believe playing pretend that goes along with this set. I definitely think um, I like that you get a vehicle to venture out. I think that's really cool. And then you do get a little bit of scenery um, as well added to it. So it adds just a little bit more than just the building. Um, and I think it looks pretty cool overall. It is quite neat. Um, and cute and compact and I like the colors. So anyways, guys, let me know what you think in the comments below and until next time, I'll see you guys later.